What's going on, YouTube World World? Welcome back to a little bit, man. Gaming bringing you some more Watch Dog Legion videos. But first things first, if we get to get the introduction out of the way, for those who are subscribed and the newly subscribers, I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Appreciate the new subscribers. I love that you subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Welcome to the family. Now that you are subscribed with the new, with the old subscribers and new subscribers, I need y'all to do me one thing and just keep liking and sharing. Just like and share, like and share and watch. Just do all those great things for me. I greatly appreciate it. Appreciate you. Love you. Thank you for subscribing. And just so to share with your friends, family, whoever likes gameplay videos and reactions and reviews and stuff. Let them know, man. Tell them about the channel. Get them over here so we can be one big family. Those who are not subscribed, subscribe. What are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button. Do it right now. Come on, right now. Right now. Do it. Thank you. Because YouTube tells me you're not subscribed. And you need to become part of the family, man. Um, yeah, that's about it. You know, we got to go 100 subscribers. We're getting a little traction in that. So, like I said, thank you to the new subscribers for helping with that. And, uh... Yeah, let's go along this journey together. I think last time we uh, left off, we just, I think we beat uh, Mary Kelly. And uh, I think we on, now that we on this uh, mission, I think hunting down, hunting zero day. Or you know what, we did Mary, uh, now I remember now, we did Mary Kelly and we started the hunting zero day uh, uh, mission. Okay, so I don't know where this guy is at. Because when you start the game, I always put you in random places and stuff like that. Also, I know they just updated the game and they released the, uh, that you could play online now. So, uh, I, if, if you guys want, let me know in the comments down below. I probably, or if you guys want, I will do videos on... I will do videos on with uh, the online gameplay. See what that's like. Check that out. I also been trying to get my friends to uh, my friend to come do it with me, but eh, look like I'm gonna be going solo. Just my friend Dub is a butthole. Give me this car. You ain't in there. Uh, how do we, we need to get there? I need to put that on the map. I do like how they tell you, like, certain people that you recruit, you know, elevate and boost your um, team. Like, this dude I got right here, he make it easier to get into, like, the restricted areas because they, they don't realize that he's turned on them. So like they just be like oh okay it's just another guard that's supposed to be here, but they, but the caveat is if they get too close to you they start suspecting that you're not who you, you're not the guy that should be there, but from a distance they don't you know really pay attention to you. Oh you know I want that car. And it's on yeah. I don't know who who car this was, but it's mine now. <laughs> oh God! Drift, fast and furious, Tokyo. Oh Lord! I drive just like him too. How he was driving in the beginning. Just a spy on this secret meeting. So, reminder: this is the parking garage where Emma Child is meeting with her inner circle. Malik has asked that you confirm she really is in charge of Zero Day before we do anything. So try and hack the camera system to see if we can get a look at that meeting. Just 
this may not. That was supposed to happen. to comply will result in forceful intervention. Uh-oh. Continuing unlawful activity will result in arrest. Surrender yourself. Failure to comply will result in extreme measures. Cease and desist, or you will be restrained. Well, we just got got out of there. It's too much of a coincidence. He slips away and our case server gets hit. Richard Malik is behind this. I've got Whitworth assets on standby, Mrs. Child. Malik is dead the moment he surfaces. What do you mean, the moment he surfaces? Are you telling me we have nothing? Yes, ma'am. For lack of a better word, he's vanished. Hasn't been at work, hasn't been at home, hasn't bought anything with a card. Of course he hasn't. He's not a moron. He knows our tools. We can't rely on filament. We have to use our fucking eyes and ears. He may have left London. Perhaps he's hiding out in the country. <laughs> this is why all these excuses smell like all shit. We do have a supporting theory, Mum. We think Malik's been in contact with DedSec. It could be they're hiding him. He's treating London like enemy territory. He's made contact with the local insurgency and got them working with him. So, here's what we're gonna do. Reallocate all resources to the dead sec file. We shake that tree long enough, Malik's bound to fall out. Do your fucking jobs. Get out there and kill some terrorists. Wow. I'm glad they, the surge just got called off. Bagley, call Malik. He's not answering. Every time. Fuck it, I'm going in. Shit, you're right, go. This might be our only chance. Char just opened a secure optic link to the home secretary. If you really want...
Oh, her car is right there. Oh, okay. To clear your names for the bombings, this may be your chance to gather the evidence. Get close to the car and I can hack in. Plugging you into Emma Child's com. Try to drive casually. This is Director Child coding in. Kilo Alpha Kilo 711. Code and voice print confirmed. You're on a secure line to the home office, Director. Hold on, Mr. Secretary. I seem to have a communications anomaly. Probably nothing, but let's switch channels to be safe. Well, that's annoying. Stay close and I'll see if I can get them back. We're reallocating resources to the DedSec file. Mr. Secretary, I wanted to bring this up directly because of the recent incident with your liaison to the service. Oh. Oh, God. You think that was DedSec? I thought we'd chalk that up to your problem, child. That, uh, well, Malik, was it? Yes. That's the sensitive bit, Mr. Secretary. There's new evidence that suggests Malik may be working with DedSec. For fuck's sake, Emma, this is a disaster. It's under control. It, it, shit, sorry, Tom, but we have to switch channels again. One moment. Ooh, it seems this conspiracy goes all the way to the top. Or close to it, anyway. Stay nearby, we've almost got it. Did she just smack a car? <laughs> Dude with the computers drive crazy in this game. I wish it was a cop. And just how exactly is any of this under control, Emma? Because one of them is currently hacking into my car's comm. That's where those anomalies are coming from. You sound suspiciously calm about that. This isn't my first day, Tom. I'm not in the car. It's a decoy. But it does have an active beacon that's calling Albion down right on top of them as we speak. I'll have one of them in custody within an hour. That was me disconnecting this time. You had better run. Uh, I have Malik for you. I'm going underground. I can't risk direct contact anymore. No, no, wait. You didn't hear her? She said she's trying to kill you. She's leading zero day. Let's end this. I did hear her. She knows I'm working with you, which means she's closer than I thought. I'm sorry, but we're out of time. Goodbye. Hunting zero day. Mrs. started smoking gun. Bellend. Fuck him. We know who's behind Zero Day now. We don't need him. We just have to find her. As it happens, when I was getting intimate with the MI6 server, I came across a list of SIRS safe houses scattered throughout the city. There are quite a few, though. Bags, try cross-referencing that list with the list of child supporters. Their GPS will lead us to her. Brilliant. Prioritize them by likelihood, Bags. Let's get this bitch. There's a potential recruit you may want to check out. Pushing your location. Okay, we'll check this person out real quick before we go before we continue on to the next uh, mission. You look like someone who's had just about enough of this, bollocks. Am I right? Oh, you are dead, Sec. Good. I need help with something. I mean, can't guarantee anything, but we'll try. What's up? You've heard of the Albion deportation squads. 
I've been working with an underground organization that helps people avoid them. But I haven't had word from any of the families we've had lately. There is something not right going on with this charity. We got this. Shouldn't be a problem finding out if this group is crooked or not. All right. Uh, we're gonna get back to the mission, though. I think it just made me start the uh, side mission, did it? Oh no, it's Smokey Gun, okay. Smokey Gun investigate the stage. That's a hell of a whistleblower name. Richard Malik. Gotta go investigate the stage, huh? Uh, when I come back, oh yeah, I gotta put it on here. So I know which way I'm going. And are you? And let's buy the car. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this game though. Like, is I I was having a discussion with my friend about how he did. Um, he, we were saying how I didn't really like part two. But I like this one, you know. People and a lot of people are saying this one was just was just as bad as part two. That is not uh, that the only one. The first one was good, but I enjoy this one. I enjoy this one way more than I'm enjoying that I enjoyed the second one. Though I might go back and play the second one on the channel just because I did just to finish it because I I did start it. Way before I even started my channel, I started. I did start playing it, and didn't not and did not. And I did. I got to a certain point that it was like, okay, Dragon Ball Z, Xenoverse Two, and all these other games I was playing, and then eventually I just lost track of it and never came back to it. And one of the reasons why but it was because I wasn't enjoying. It. Up until that point where I stopped playing it, I didn't even enjoy it for real. It was like the story didn't catch me at all, but the story of this one is like, to me, this, like, I try to explain to my friend, this one, the story of this one is way better than the story of the second one, to the point where I actually want to play this You're one. near an Everchart's hideout. Poke around to see if you can find a clue. I've got this. Wow. Uh, is it a, where is that thing? There's it, gotta be a way in here. I can't get through that way. I'm trying to just scout to see is it any way I could get it, get up. Okay, that's what that's at. Yeah. yeah, I can't. Is there a way to get through this way? Okay, yeah, I can get. I see how I can get through. I'm about to go all the way. Oh my lord, this bus! Huh? I just probably pissed him off. Oh, I just see where I was supposed to go. I almost yeah, missed the ladder. Yeah, yeah. yeah, okay. Yeah, whatever. Is this it right here? I thought it was sitting right up here. Oh, there we go. Oh, you know what? I think I... I can just go up and down.
see who's behind door number one. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Don't move! Don't Hands move! Up. Oh man, it was a trap. Spy dude. Hello, hello. Someone else slept off work, and now it's your turn. Fantastic. Terribly sorry, everyone, but one of your teammates has been kidnapped. What the fuck? Sirs has got to be behind this. That was way too clever for Albion acting on their own. The question's why? Well, they're being tortured for information about Malik, of course. I thought that was obvious when we saw that meeting where Emma Charles said, and I'm paraphrasing, kidnap someone and torture them for information about Malik. Fuck. We have to find Malik. Bags, there's got to be some way to get him a signal. Sure, I've marked a location for you. In his eagerness to leave in a huff, Malik failed to encrypt his last message. It was almost too easy to trace it back to his safe house. Okay. And? Malik has a stick so far up his ass it controls his thoughts. By now he'll have noticed his error and moved. But there's no way he isn't monitoring that safe house computer. If we use it to send a message like, return our calls or we tell child everything, I'm sure the stick will compel him to listen. Okay, let's try it. Agreed. Let's do it. Uh oh. Myers just smacked that dude off his bike. But yeah, this game um, this game is like I know it feels different than Watch Dogs 2. You know, I really it like this I really having fun with this game more than I was with Watch Dogs 2. Cause I I can tell you this where I'm at now with this game. I didn't even get like this far in Watch Dogs 2. Like I was kind of sort of still at the beginning of the game. I mean, one of the things I like about this game is like uh, that you that you don't have like a singular like main character that you play as. You just got this guy who who you can recruit off the street, and then you just got to keep. Oh Lord. I didn't mean to hit that guy. But yeah, it's like you can play as these people as long as you got enough people Malik's to recruit. Malik's safe house it. is somewhere around here, but it will be well hidden. Maybe have a look for a slightly off-color brick or an inconspicuous lever. Uh, search for my, uh... Oh, man. Can I... I need to hijack this bitch. This is a camera right here. Well, of course it's a camera, but this is. I'm guessing he is gonna be. I'm gonna need him to uh, get in here some way, somehow. Oh man. Well, at least I got that. Guess we gotta find our way up there, huh? 
Oh no, I ain't like that. Got you. That did not want to go that way. Oh, how did I do it there? Oh, okay, I have to climb up. Wait, let me do it for that one? Nope. Mm -hmm. Get over to this side. Uh... Hmm. That lever does look a bit dodgy, doesn't it? Bagley, how about some help? Right. It seems Malik's made some upgrades to security. And since he's both a security expert and a paranoid lunatic, I don't know if you can handle this one. Okay, guys, when we come back, we're going to be finishing this mission. And, uh, yeah, we're going to get to some more Watch Dog Legion gameplay. But first things first, you got to hit this button up here for more uh, Watch Dog Legion videos. You can hit that. If you can hit that button down below, which is the upper right button for more Watch Dogs video, uh, Watch Dog Legion videos. And if you can hit that lower right button to subscribe to my channel or hit any other wonderful videos to see more of my great, amazing content. Uh, to the next one. And I will see you in the next one. Peace.